have a lot to fill you in on. Oh, but this, this is not what we're gonna talk about today. We're gonna talk about camp lights. It's kind of an unglamorous topic, but if you don't have like semi-decent lighting that's convenient and easy to use when you're camping, it can kind of be like a real pain in the butt to like do anything. Last year at SEMA, my friend Mike introduced me to these really cool dudes from Claymore Lights. Actually, Big Tent Outdoors, they sell Claymore Lights. They were telling me that their Claymore lights are actually, that the, the Claymore light brand is the premium outdoor camp lighting brand in Korea. Now I hadn't heard of them, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything. Um, many of you have actually seen their lights. Uh, Gear Aid took one of their lights. Well, they didn't take it. They they bought a whole bunch of them, rebranded it, white labeled, whatever the term is, and resold them in the United States. So anyway, this company, Big Tent Outdoors, is now importing these Claymore lights into the uh, United States and Canada. They're also the Canadian distributor or dealer for iCamper, which they don't sell the iCamper down in the States. That comes from a different direction. So in this video, I just wanted to go over real quick these new Claymore lights that I got. So I filmed that like back in January and I've had quite a bit of time to use these lights since. I have three of these three-face lights, I think is what they're called. I've got uh, the biggest one, the medium sized one, and then there's one size smaller that I actually keep up with the tent, which is why it's not with me right now. I've got two of these, these are the Ultra 2s. Um, these are the ones, the Gear Aid ones that I was telling you about earlier in the video. I've got two of these guys, which is the Ultra Mini, and then they sent me a couple of these guys. Um, this is not the, the best one of the three. This is the, the, the less expensive, cheaper version. Uh, the other one is in my truck. Uh, you can put these on the bill of your, of your cap. See? So right now I have these on the brightest setting and I'm looking over here at the screen and it is like, ooh, bright. Let me, uh, let me adjust this down real quick. How's that? Let me bring it down a stitch. So before it was at ISO 1000, with shutter at one over 50, after 2.8, now ISO is at 200. So these lights are really bright. There's five different dimming levels. You can change to, I guess, three different hues, really. You've got a cool, you've got a warm, and then you've got a mixture between the, bolt, the two, which is like a really, really good, I guess, neutral color. They're pretty heavy, and the weight is not the LED. LED is very, very little. LED diodes are very light. It's the battery, which means they last a really, really long time, and they can dual double as a portable charging battery device thingy. You can take your USB, you can plug it in right here, and you can, you can charge your phone. The other thing I really like about these Ultra 2s, you've got this tilting handle thing, and on the side, it actually tells you what degree it's at. You can kind of like angle it at different, you know, different levels if you want. But the biggest thing that I really like about this arm right here is I use this little hook to hook it up on the little poles that hold the tent awning flap thing in the jigger. To hold it up. On the back here, you've got you've got the power switch. You can make it brighter, make it darker, and then you can change the hue. So you can make it can make it cool, neutral, cool, and warm. Ooh. Oh man, I can't see anything. I'm just like, I'm seeing spots. So these lights, these are called the three-face lights. They have these uh, right here. It's got these handles so that you can put these, these it's got these straps. It comes with these straps. Um, and the straps are kind of handy, I guess. I haven't really used them, but you've got multiple different ways that you can, you know, adjust them. You've got multiple ways you can just adjust these straps. It also has this whole 
back here, this threaded hole. This is a, you also have one of those threaded holes right there. And one of the things that's kind of cool and handy is you can use that for like a tripod mount or something like that. They also have these other, actually I have it on the back of these little magnets that can screw right onto the back here. Firstly, these magnets are super duper duper strong. So like on my steel bumper on the back, so it's super, super handy. So anywhere you got metal, you can just stick the thing on there. It's really, really strong. Plus these hooks are, it's all the same thread. You've got three different brightnesses on the middle and the sides. And you also have the ability to change the hue just like, just like these lights. So you've got uh, is this warm, cool and neutral. I think this is cool. That's warm. That's neutral. All the three face lights are the same in the sense that they have obviously the dimming on the sides and on the, on the middle and then the hue changing capability. They also, just like these lights, they have the ability to be able to charge USB devices. I like it because it's got a slim profile, obviously packs away in the tent, really, really nice. I had charged it one time before my trip in January, I guess in December when I first got the lights and I haven't recharged it yet. That's one of the biggest, to me, one of the biggest selling points about these lights is that they really do last a long time. Then I've got these little guys. These guys are super, super nifty. Um, they're kind of like a miniature version of these. Uh, they've got a little hang taggy thingamajigger. And then these right here, you can you know turn them on just like that and then you hold down this power button and then it'll turn it way up and then it'll turn it way down and dim it can you see a dog that's that's the moon isn't that cool they also have this um move this like this so you can kind of you know prop it up like this and then they've got this little hangy thing that you can hang it on stuff you have the same threaded hole mount thing right there and then you have your power button right there And then also with this one, just like you have on the other ones, you've got three different hues, which I think this is neutral, this is cool, and this is warm. Okay, so my favorite things about all these lights, here's my favorite things. Firstly, they're small and compact and portable, obviously. The batteries all last for a really, really long time. Batteries last a long time, they're really, really bright, and they're waterproof. That's one of my favorite things about it is because I try to put my stuff away before I go to bed in case it rains or some moisture or whatever, but you know what? I have left these out, it has rained, they've been just fine, they're rated IPv6, whatever. Anyway, you can leave them out in the rain, gonna be just fine. And last but not least, my, one of my favorite things about them is that whatever the frequency these are, whatever the frequency the light emitting whatever is, it works for cameras. Most of the time LED lights, if they're not like the right kind of frequency or whatever, you'll see like a wave going in the camera. I guess all the LEDs are on my office. They're the right, <laughs> I don't know. The point is I can actually use these for camera lighting. I believe that there is greatness inside all of us. Best believe what you believe is what you will become. That what ain't given is a, what you give out gets returned. Life's a gamble, roll the dice. Days on earth ain't promised, we just all live in on borrowed time. As you might assume, you can find a lot more information about these lights on Big Tent Outdoors website. They've got a lot of really detailed information about each one of the lights, the ratings, the battery life, and you know specifics like 
uh, the fact that the LEDs are actually like Samsung LEDs and batteries are very highly rated. If you have any questions about these lights, you can always hit me up on Instagram. You can follow me on Instagram. You can follow me on YouTube. You can like and subscribe and share and all this stuff. Blah, blah, blah. I've had these lights now for, I guess, six months. I've used them on several camping trips. They've never failed me. I really, really like them. I would consider this a medium term review. <laughs> I plan on using these for a long time and I'm really excited to be using them because they work really well and I really, really like them. Once again, thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, hit the like button. If you didn't like it, hit the double like button twice. Make sure you share it with your friends. If you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. We'll see you guys in the next video. Messages between the lines. Keep your eyes wide open so that you don't ever miss the signs. Don't need no baggage. No, I don't. Don't need no baggage. No, I don't.